Hey guys, welcome back. This is Twisted Princess here with, oh goodness, Life is Strange, part, or episode two out of time, part three, if we ever figure out where we are at. Oh, don't rewind. We want to give Chloe our bottles and see what the hell happens next. Thanks, Max. Welcome, I guess. Since you had to have five bottles, took forever to find. Wait, one more for the road? You're serious about this. We're gonna shoot all these bottles without wasting a single bullet. Max, you have to help me aim. Oh, great. Show me the way, Max. Whoa, don't rewind I need yet. To see you shoot first. All right, so we want to go right. Aim a bit to the right. Sir, yes, sir. Oh, yes! Did you see that shit, Max? No. I closed Don't my eyes. Fucking cool. Now for the second bottle. Now, Max, where do I aim? You're on target. Pull the trigger. Aim a bit up. Oh, shit. I thought I told her up. I'm not rewinding far enough. Up. Aim slightly above. Right between the eyes. Watch out, Nathan. Now yeah, because I'm going to be able to help you rewind and, and aim better. Target. I want to get creative here. Give me something to shoot, Max. Whoa. Shoot that. Aim at that old blue plank here. I hate old planks. That's not what she wanted to do. She wanted to make... Hello, um... what should I shoot? Fine, since you won't play, I'm gonna shoot this barrel. <sighs> Yawn. All right. Oops. Give me something to shoot, Max. Shoot this. I bet you want to blow apart those old computer monitors. Let's reboot them with a bullet. Uh. Old. That did nothing. She wants to break the jars. Now shoot that. Let's take out this wheel rim on your left. Taking out the wheel rim now. Hello, yes! Okay, she's happy, we're good. Nice shooting, Tech. Now that's what I'm talking about. Satisfied? <laughs> like, never. So I want one more uber cool trick shot. How about using that junker for a target now? Dude, I need a target before I shoot. Shoot. How about aiming for the left tire? Adios, spinning wheel of death. I don't know. Whoa. Uber cool. I cannot believe this is for reals. My best friend is a superhero. Now it's your turn to bust a cap. I don't feel I don't too know. well. Max, your nose. Damn. I don't feel so super. Max! Whoa! Sorry, I am so glad we have volume control on the keyboard. Otherwise, we'd have been screwed. Oh, we can't skip anything. We can't do anything. You freaked me out there. Do you feel any better now? A little. Thanks for helping me. Just give me a minute. 
too much action for Arcadia? Maybe not enough. This is kind of fun. Scary and stupid, but fun. Let me know when you feel okay. God, this power really messes with my head. Glad I feel normal again. I better go chat up Chloe. Why? She's going to kill you. Okay. Looks like you're ready to lock and load. You think? I don't think so. I don't know about this. Are you afraid of getting in trouble? Oh, boo-hoo. Max is afraid. I know you can handle this. And I'm here to guide you. Make me proud, sister. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. Or is it Bonnie and Clyde? Excuse us, Frank. Oh, sorry, Chloe. Don't let me get in the way of your bonding. I heard the gunshots and the breaking glass. It's cute that you're playing with guns. Just like me at your age. We're not anything alike, man. We both need money. In fact, you need it so bad, you owe me a shitload, don't you, Chloe? Uh-oh. Huh? You'll get your money. Don't they all say that? You know, even when they're broke and acting tough? What are you hiding there, girly? Let me see. Mm-mm. Where did you get that bracelet? A friend. And it's none of your goddamn business. You're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. No, it wasn't. You stole that shit. Give it to me right now, asshole. You better step back before you regret uh, it, girl. Uh... You mean it. You want me to cut you, bitch? Please. Please step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Come on, girly. Shoot. Shit, me. I should have shot him. Ah, oh, Christ. You're more like Abbott and Costello. Nice piece. I'll consider this interest on your loan. Thanks. You have until Friday to pay me, or I'll track you down with this interest. Uh, we gotta shoot him. Have a good play, kids. I can't rewind. You really stood your ground. I freaked. I don't like guns. It'll be hard to keep Nathan off my ass. My step shit will have his other gun sealed in an electrified bunker by now. Sorry, Chloe. I've never held a gun on a human being before. Not cool. Yeah, okay. Know, we'll let this play through. Really. I'm actually relieved it worked out this way instead. Now what? More guns out there. Let's blow. My secret lair didn't feel secret today. At least Frank is gone. He won't fuck with us again. He just wants his money. Oh, the man. fuck did she get Frank herself took into? Gun because of me. Yeah, I don't think so. I think he was gonna take it either way. Chloe's wowser. Why did Frank have Rachel's bracelet? We need to talk about this. Yep, but now we'll follow Chloe. Or Chloe. I can't believe you basically gave him my gun. Here you go, Frank. You can't keep getting mad at me. Especially for stupid shit. I'm not mad. It adds up in my mind as people letting me down. Wow. I just liked having that gun, man. Now you have me to protect you. She's I'm a just bitch. Her. Me too. I think. Chloe... Why the hell are you hanging around scary losers like Frank? Good question. It's weird. Let's take a break and I'll talk. Feels like a different world, huh? I wish we could stay forever. Can we build another pirate fort and keep the world out? We need a new secret hangout. At least Frank wouldn't find us. Are you okay, Max? Seriously, Chloe, this is scary. What if Frank tries to track us down? I'm sorry, but Frank isn't as hardcore as he fronts. All he cares about is his cash, stash, and mangy dog. Chloe, are you for reals? Frank just took your gun and threatened us. He's armed and clearly dangerous. Clearly. Max, I know. Crazy shit is the new normal for me. 
That's why I plan to leave Arcadia Bay without paying Frank off. Now, tell me exactly what's going on between you and Frank. Does he have a last name? Frank Bowers, he's just a dealer, where I get my weed. The one in your joint, remember? Anyway, Frank and I kind of hung out. Kind of? Hung out? You don't mean you... Ah, oh, no, we didn't have sex. Gross, man. He never even tried. I just made the mistake of borrowing money so Rachel and I could bail out of here. That's it? No. I want to know how Frank got Rachel's bracelet. What do you think? I think we have to be careful and keep an eye on this guy. Without him eyeballing us, okay? Ah, it's so weird talking to you about this insane crap. We haven't hung out this much since we were tweens. And it's like no time has passed. Yeah, except you're a bossy little was here to meet bitch. You. Do you think that Rachel and I would have been friends? You're not that different. She had... has a great eye for images and for art. Plus, she's a smartass like you. We would all be hella best friends forever. I know she must be as really, cool as I'm, you are. She's the smartass? No. I have no doubt we'll meet soon. Railroad tracks always make me feel better. I have no idea why. Kerouac knew. It's the romance of travel and movement. The sound of the train whistle at Look night. Look at the bead poet here. I'd rather be a good photographer. You are. You just have to stop being afraid. Great. How the fuck? What's that noise? The train. Oh shit. Pull. I can't even move it an inch. Open. Awesome. It's not locked. Um Please, give me Wait, there's a crowbar. Take that. I can definitely use this bad boy. Okay, what's up here? Ooh, push this. Damn. Something is blocking the drum. Oh, uh, okay. <sighs> There we go. Max, oh, it I didn't roll. Move the drum. Push. Get me out of here, Max. Fuck you, I bitch. Have to help lift Chloe up. Shit, she's still stuck. We have to go push it again. Really? Damn, something is blocking the. Hurry! All right. Whoa. Look at that. There we go. Crowbar that out the way. Please get me out of here. Space. Ah, push. I have to help lift Chloe up. The coming. Back, yeah, please. the train is coming. You're fine. Good God Almighty. Damn. That was close. You saved me again. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. Yeah, because I keep saving I your fucking ass. And legs, so I wish there was a less violent way for you to save me. And now the trains can't get to the lumber mill. Oops. 
Aren't you glad I took you away to a nice, quiet, desolate spot? It was cool to spend time in your lair, but I have to get back to school before my next class. Since you're the mysterious superhero, I'll be your faithful chauffeur and companion. My powers might not last, Chloe. That's okay. We will. Forever. As long as you stop being such, such a fucking bitch. She's kind of weird. She's a chill a little. Thanks for the ride, Chloe. Right on time for my art lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. Explain what? Snow equals a ginormous twister that takes out Arcadia Bay? You're high. Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours, and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? What do you know about chaos theory, Miss I Hate Math? Five years ago, asswipe. Some people change. And your situation is the perfect storm for quantum physics. Okay. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Don't they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar! Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. Whatever you say. And we're back to the school for class. Yay! Not. Great. Vortex Club. I have a little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some wandering. And fuck you. Whoops. Yeah, let's look at these. Join us or die. <laughs> Speak. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. Really? Oh, like you care. I'm not anti soiree. You seem anti fashion, though. A Vortex Club party has a strict dress code. Do you even have a dress? <laughs> Sorry, but nice try. Fuck you, bitch. Seriously. Hello, climate change. Okay. Let's look at that. I'm going to find out what happened to you, Rachel. What is that? Does anybody believe this shit? Mm, no. Alright, so what are we supposed to stumble across? Let's look at that. Blackwell sure takes its swimming seriously. But otters are cute. Go otters. That missing persons poster is everywhere. Oh, hey you! Excuse me, Mr. Madsen? I know things got a little heated yesterday in Chloe's room. Was that really your reefer? No, it belonged to a friend of mine. Are you going to bust me now, Mr. Madsen? Even I'm not that much of an asshole. And I am sorry about yesterday. Uh-huh. But upset. Cannabis is not a big deal to you. But it has been to Chloe. You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was out raising a lot more hell. She's better than that. All you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. What about Kate? You stepped between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Max, this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, including you. 
That'll take more than surveillance. So he evidence. knows something he's it will not take sharing. More than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. That's all, Max. Fine. Uh. Okay. I still have time. I could go see Warren playing Oops, science class. In the lab. Woo! -hoo. Think, big brain. Think. Hey, Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Perfect timing. I need help with this. This poor black thing. eye. Asking me for help means you're screwed. I have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide, Dr. Max. Uh, let's go with potassium. I'm not sure why you're letting me decide your fate, but go potassium. Potassium it shall be. If this works, you get a free hug. Weird That's pretty science. cool. All right, so let's try sodium. Can't be that hard. Hey, Warren. Maxwell Silver Hammer. Asking me for. I have to add either. A okay, sodium. I have a vision. Go diem. Go diem. That's the worst pun I've ever heard. Yet Max has spoken. Let's see what it does. Sodium it is. Nothing. So let's go back. Oops, speak. Hey, Warren. Maxwell, asking. I have to add either. Lots of potassium. I actually think you should use a lot of potassium. I mean, a shitload. See, look at that smile. You're going to become a scientist yet. No. Let's do this thing. She blinded me with science. Yes! That was a blast! But let's keep it a professional secret. Cool? Yep. Alright, where are we heading now? Oh. Hello, you can't help me. I'm trying. But you have to understand my position. Why? You don't understand mine. Nobody does. Wait. Nobody. Or not? Sorry to bother you, Mr. Jefferson. I'm only bothered when you avoid turning in photos. But you know this. So what can I do for you, Max? Just between you and me, I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. She doesn't deserve that. Of course not. Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough? <sighs> the one time I choose not to take a picture. Right? Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max? I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral video? Kate is freaked out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? She what if she well, didn't? But maybe she doth protest too much. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? Yes, I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel, too. But think about yourself, Max. Wow. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. That was a private conversation. Not that I wouldn't tell you. This is a serious accusation, Max. Yeah, no so shit. you don't believe me? I would never make something like this up. I hope so, Max. 
But it's easy to point fingers. If Mr. Madsen claims you might be a pot dealer as he did, should I believe him? Listen, should I? Excuse me, Max. Wow, fuck Hello. you. Yes? Uh, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. Alright, asshole. While everybody wants to be fucking bitches. All right, guys, so while we get situated here, um, please don't forget to sub, follow, like, Twitch, Twitter, Facebook. Leave me comments in the section below if you would like to. I check those on a daily. And we'll catch you in the next one. Have a great whatever it is, wherever you are.